there's a plastic bag in the river. We just grab it and, and we just pick it up and put it in the trash where it belongs. Aiden Floyd was one of many who joined our WSA 9 team at Oxen Hill Farm in Maryland this Saturday morning to pick up trash along the Potomac River. It's all part of our Environment Matters Cleanup Day. You know, a lot washes up along shore at this park, like often, and you need those volunteers to, to help keep that clean. Absolutely. It's a consistent effort. It really requires us to um, have volunteer events all the time, and so we have ample volunteer opportunities for uh, the public to come and engage with us. Uh, to help us out. Oxen Hill Farm was one of five locations where WSA 9 employees joined with volunteers in the community to clean up our environment. Chief Meteorologist Topper Shutt helped to clean up the Carter Barron Amphitheater at Rock Creek Park. You know, James Brown was here, Roberta Flack was here, Earth, Wind and Fire was here, Ray Charles was here. I mean, so, and Chuck Brown performed his last concert here. Uh, just a jewel in the middle of Rock Creek Park. A jewel that hasn't seen a concert here since 2011, but a renovation project is in the works and cleaning up is step one. Um, Rock Creek Conservancy has about 50 volunteers out helping to protect the concrete, get rid of debris, paint over graffiti, and really make sure that the structure stays in great shape until it can be renovated. Fletcher's Cove Boathouse in Northwest DC was another cleanup destination. Yeah, come take a look at this. We have got an abandoned shoe up here. We have glass bottles, but by the end of the day, if our efforts are a success, I assure you all of this will be gone. WSA 9 traffic specialist Michelle Logan was joined by meteorologist Kayla McGrath and many volunteers to pick up litter along the water. And in Virginia, a group of volunteers, including meteorologist Michaela Lucero, gathered at Dean Park and the Boys and Girls Club of Manassas to clean up and spruce up the place. So we're going to be uh, uh, mulching, weeding, uh, power washing the Boys and Girls Club and uh, just picking up any trash that we see. In Alexandria, I was joined by nearly a dozen of my WUSA 9 colleagues to pick up trash at Four Mile Run Wetlands Trail. We found dozens of bottles, beer caps, and cigarette butts scattered throughout the park. I've been able to clean up, and that's what I like to do is pick up and clean up. Cleaning up our environment and working towards creating a better future for guys like Aiden. I'm excited. I'm just, I'm just ready. I'm just ready for this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How much trash are you going to pick up today? A lot? as much as I can find.